This video is designed to show students and parents how to access online content in Teams. First, you need to go to Class Link. You can find a button for Class Link on the Osceola School's webpage, as well as the webpage of your individual school. When I click on the button, it brings me to a sign-in portal. I click on the blue sign-in button. Now I need to enter my username and password. My username is my student ID number. My password is the password that I use to get into the computer in the morning or when I'm in my class. Once I'm in class link, I need to look for the Office 365 icon. If I can't find it, just go to the search bar and start typing in the word Office. It will appear and I can either click on the word Office or I can click on the icon. It asks me if I want to install the extension. In this case, I'm going to say continue to website. If you plan on going to Office 365 often, you may want to install the extension. It brings me to a sign in screen and I'm going to enter my email address, which is my student ID at student.osceolaschools.net. Then I'm going to click on next. I'm going to enter the same password that I use to get into class link and that I use every morning to log in to my computer at school. Now that I'm into my Office 365 account, I'm going to find the Teams button. If this isn't an option, clicking on All Apps will take me to a screen that will show me all of the apps that I have access to. I'm going to choose Teams. Once I get into Teams, I can see that I'm already added to a team by my teacher. If I needed to add a team, I would click right here to join or create a team. And then I would enter the code that my teacher gave me, usually a combination of letters and numbers. I can use the back button to get back to my team that I already am a part of. To get into my team, I simply click on the team and I can open it up and see my assignments and see what's in my team.